Hey, welcome to my channel. I'm walking out here on snow and ice. We still have lots of snow. So today you see I'm holding this glider in my hand and that's what we're gonna fly today. I fly drones, but uh, Cafago, this company online, sent me this glider and it's powered. See, there's a motor in the back and it comes with a three channel remote control. Now, what's cool about this is that this glider is, uh, well, it's only like, I think it's less than $80. You know, it's, it's not very expensive. And what's really cool it's for guys like me that fly drones. Uh, it's designed for, you know, beginners because it has a sensing system in it and it will keep itself level. And if I'm doing anything goofy and it wants to fly like this, it will keep itself correct so that I don't crash it. At least that's in theory what the manual says. Of course, I've been known to crash planes many times. So, uh, here, let me grab the controller and uh, show you that, and then we'll get the setup. It comes with a battery, and it's all set to go, and you can even put a camera on it if you want. Uh, if I don't destroy this the first few flights, I'll try to put a camera on it and uh, get some footage. Also, at the end of this video, there's an unboxing. I'll show you the unboxing of um, everything that comes with this plane, and you can check it out then. So let me show you the controller right now, and we'll get it flying. So this is the little controller it comes with. Put this on the ground so you can see it. And you can see on the left joystick, you see it's doesn't sit in the center so that's your throttle so you move it up to get the amount of power you want and this here would be your up and down now if you're like me and you're used to flying drones we all know that if we want to make a drone go forward we push it our little right joystick this way well on a plane <laughs> that's going to drive it into the ground so on a plane if you want a plane to go up you pull this back and the plane goes up and if you push it down the plane goes nose down and if you want the plane to go forward faster and faster you just push the throttle it's that simple. And of course, to turn, you know, normal stuff, left, right. So uh, let's go try this. So the forward section here just pops right off. And in there, I'll just pull this out. That's the battery that it comes with. It's a little two cell battery. And this gives you about uh, 15 minutes of flight time, as long as you don't keep the throttle on full blast all the time, because it is a glider. So let me just stick that back in the nose. And I'll show you. This is how it goes in. You can see it down here. Slides in the nose like that. Just connect the two wires. Oop, right here, connect these two wires and it will start up. Just make sure you have your remote on and they will connect. So I'll turn that on. There we go. I'll connect these two wires. I don't know if you can hear this as I move this here, playing around here, all that squeaky sound. That's all the servos moving. So let me see if I could show you this on the back. There we go, there's the elevator. Now watch what happens when I lift this up. See, notice how the elevator goes down because it says, whoa, you're going up. It's going to point the nose down. And if I point the nose down, it goes up. It goes, whoa, I got to bring the plane back level. So that keeps your plane pretty much flying quite well. And down here, this is your throttle control. So watch the prop. It's that simple. Now, I also have to mention on here, there's a button right here. If you don't want it to be flying in sort of like a safe mode, just press that button and this light will flash and then it won't try to level out for you can, and you can have more control of the plane. All right, it's pretty simple. I've never flown this plane before, so it's either gonna crash or fly really well. The wind is this way, so I'm gonna put the, the prop on a bit and just throw it. And there we go, she's a flying. I have it away up there. I'm gonna turn the motor off and just let it glide. There, motor's off, silent, gliding over top. Gliding, 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 gliding. I have a tendency to want to use the left joystick to turn because I'm used to doing that with uh, yawing or draw stuff. You don't use that left joystick on this plane. It's just, you just use the right joystick. Let me see, I'm gonna bring it over. I'll bring it around to me so we'll get it nice and close. So for a landing, all you'd want to do is shut off the motor so watch this, I'm gonna shut off the motor and let it glide. And glide, beautiful, beautiful landing. And now the last thing I'll try is that little button here to put it into pro mode. So let me try that, put this on. All right, so in pro mode, it won't stabilize itself. I'm just doing circles here so you can see it in the camera, nice and close. I'll turn with it. Anytime you're gonna nose down, just gun the throttle. This is gliding, coming right at me. I could probably catch it. I'm just gonna bring the nose up and watch this. Just before you land, bring the nose up and life is good. 
Okay, I put a little camera on there, my Mobius, and I don't know if the weight's gonna change. I've tried to put it at center of mass, so uh, we'll see if it flies with the little camera and get some footage. Coming around by me. Oh, that was a little low. It's very, very, very easy to fly. Got it going nice and low to the ground. Get some cool footage. Woohoo! I don't know how anybody could not enjoy this. This is just amazing. Let's go through the post. Woohoo! Through the post! Two points! I like flying it really low to the ground. It's pretty cool here. Alright, let's bring this in for a landing right down here. There we go. So my final thoughts on this here glider plane is that it's pretty freaking amazing. <laughs> I don't fly planes, but I really like this one. It's so simple to fly. It's like I said, the left joystick, just put your throttle wherever you want. And then on the right joystick, that's all you use. You just move it to uh, put the nose up or put the nose down or turn left to right. That's it. It's like a child could fly this. Well, I'm like a big child, so it's easy for me. All right, so next we have an unboxing on this thing followed by, um, well, the end of the video. So uh, if you want to see more about this here drone, watch the unboxing. Uh, links are below to where you can get it on Cafago. They're the ones who sent it to me. And I'm pretty sure it's like only $80, which is pretty amazing. You know, a motorized glider with servos and a three-channel radio included. And the batteries included. So it's all good. All right, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. I have a thumb here someplace. And uh, stay tuned for the unboxing. And then uh, go get yourself one of these things. It's pretty cool. All right, get you the next video. Bye. And now a super quick unboxing of the Sky King powered glider. Here we have the contents of the box. So let me see. Uh, it looks like I have my remote controller over here to control the plane. I've got some wings here. Got uh, two wings. You know, I'm not very good with planes, but I've got two wings. I've got the charging unit down here. Take out the controller and you can see it as a mode two. This sits down. So that's going to be my throttle for sure. Power button. It's going to take a few batteries in the back. Four AA batteries required. See if I can get this out. Here we go. We can see a lot of the fuselage right here. So we have our little prop in the back. No, that is not broken. It just bends down so that if it, I guess if it lands upside down, your prop will get damaged. So when it spins, it just flops right out. On the bottom, you can see a hard piece of plastic here for landing on the ground. Nothing on the back, but you can see there is a servo connection here so that this can go up and down your elevator and right here you have another servo connector right there so this can go left to right and they all go inside 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 and in here we should see everything there we go now we can see everything inside so inside you have your battery it's a 7.4 volts that's a two cell at 300 milliamps inside you can see your two servos one to send the plane up and down and the other left and right and you get this little hard piece of plastic very very hard or is it metal i'm not really sure and of course that's going to go through the two wings across so that the wings stay very stable and secure and it comes with one extra piece of foam here there's an optional fpv camera mine does not come with one and this looks like it goes like this and and snaps into the back somehow like that and I guess the camera sits on here so you have FPV when you're flying and this brings me to the end of the review of this three channel fixed wing glider if you enjoyed it please give it a thumbs up I would really appreciate that if you have questions post your questions below I'll get back to you as soon as I can and uh, yeah stay tuned for many more videos on this channel of RC products take care